Hello everyone, I am Sith Lord 249 and welcome back to another Star Wars figure review. Um, before I start today's review, um, I'd just like to say that, as you notice behind me, it's really quite dark. Um, it's really not nighttime here, but it's more cloudy, rainy, dull, cold, you know, that kind of typical weather that really doesn't make the lighting very well, so I decided to keep my blinds closed and everything. But anyway, um, I have my reviewing lamp, so that'll help me out whenever I do my reviews. Um, but anyway, on to today's review. I'm going to be doing Anakin Skywalker or Darth Vader as, it go as he goes by. So here he is. Okay, now here's the packaging. Very nice picture of him right there. Very nice picture of him right there dueling Obi Wan Kenobi. As you can see, it's the 2008 packaging. Now, I'll just quickly read to you from the quick bio on the back. It says, Now a Sith apprentice, Vader rejects Obi Wan's pleas to return away to the dark side. Instead, he attacks Kenobi in a devastating lightsaber duel on Mustafar. Destruction is Vader's only thought. But in the end, he is the one who lies near death on the black sand shores. So there's just that bio right there. So enough about the packaging now onto the figure. He is really good. His um, karma is soft goods. He has a ball jointed head, ball hinged shoulders, swivel elbows, which really tend to come off quite easy but they're not too bad on this figure. He has a swivel forearm on this side <coughs> and a swivel wrist on this, in this side. He has ball jointed hips which are really good. Ball hinged knees and ball hinged ankles. So he has pretty decent articulation and he does come with the standard Anakin Skywalker lightsaber. So really not a great deal to say about this figure. I give him 3 out of 5. He's pretty good. I like clone troopers better, so they get a higher ranking. But for a Jedi, he's pretty cool. And he goes nicely with my 501st Legion. Uh, so I'm starting to kind of build up a little army with him. <laughs> and uh, retail price for this guy, not that bad. Um, it's actually cheaper. It's now 6.29. And the other figures are 749, so that's a pretty good price. So if you see him in stores, I highly recommend that you pick him up. He's worth he's well worth your money. And um, he's at a cheap price. So if you see him, pick him up. So I hope you enjoyed taking a look at this figure with me today. Um, hopefully the weather will be better so I can do more reviews. But until then, keep collecting and may the force be with you. Thank you for watching.